Hi Air Signs, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising and those of you cross-watching, welcome to your Tower Love Messages. So today we're going to take a look at and see what are you, what is your special person telling their friends about you. Okay, so what is it that they're telling their close friends, their connecting energies about you? This is going to be a general reading guys, so please just keep that in mind. If you're after personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address just below the video here in the show more section below. Okay, with all of that being said, I want you to take a moment, focus on your special person, your romantic energy, and we're going to see what is it that they're tell sorry, what is it that they're telling their friends about you? Got tongue tied then. bottom of the deck that crowns the reading you've got the page of wands you've got a lot of fire energy here okay and it, it it feels like there's a lot of attraction there's a very strong passion a very strong chemistry a very strong electrical charge in the energies here okay very strong charge there's a spark a, a spark of passion um, a spark of fiery passion that burns very brightly between the two of you. Your person is very drawn to you. They're very attracted to you. They're very interested in you. They're very, um, you know, there's a very strong sexual chemistry, a very strong sexual energy here. You draw them in like a moth to a flame type of energy. Your person wants to get closer to you. Okay, now... If this is someone that you've started out with just recently in the early days, then this is someone who's absolutely enthralled by you. They're very intrigued here. They're very curious. For some of you, it does feel like it's the early stages of an um, of a connection because it feels like the excitement is building. Um, some of you are in the like the honeymoon phase of this connection, so your person is feeling really great. I feel like they're saying very positive things about you. They're very attracted. Um, to you they keep going on about how how hot and how good-looking you are okay you've definitely charmed the pants of this person um, if you have known this person for quite some time for some of you I feel like this could be like a okay either you are doing long-distance relationship with this person or there's a bit of a, a separation a bit of a disconnection between the two of you right now they are reaching towards their friends for advice someone here is saying that they should this is strange but that they should see you or go visit you that they should see you they should connect with you reach out to you connect with you or go visit you so is it because they're in a for like they're in i'm getting across a body of water a body of water is coming up very strongly here so for, for some of you, it could mean that this is a long-distance relationship, okay? For others of you, it feels like, okay, maybe this person is at a distance, like in a different city or in a different state. For a lot of you, I'm seeing it's a country, a different country here. Um, it feels like this person wants to come closer to you. So either they want to grow more intimate with you, you know, they want to connect with you more intimately and physically, or this person wants... I'm seeing air travel here, so... Someone here is encouraging because your person is thinking about seeing you, okay, traveling to see you. And a close connecting energy, or maybe this close connecting energy, this friend of theirs is currently overseas. I'm getting air travel like very strongly here. Someone here is encouraging this person, whether they're overseas, this energy, or whether this is like a close friend that is saying that they should travel to see you overseas. Your person is... Your person thinks the absolute world of you, okay? Your person is very attracted to you. They feel like they're punching their, they're punching above their weight with you, okay? This person feels like you're really good looking. Sometimes they're in awe 
Um, they're stunned by the fact that, you know, they managed to catch your, catch your attention and, you know, you settled for them. This person feels like you're a little out of their league here. They're a little bit uncertain about either how to approach the situation or how to go about things. Your person feels like you're very mature, you're very intelligent, you're very intellectual here. Um, they, they hold you in high regard, okay? And they're really, when they talk about you to their friends, uh, they like to show off because they feel good about, they feel good about the type of person, they feel good about how you make them feel when they're with you. Like they feel good about themselves, okay? Because you make them want to be a better person here. Yeah, your person thinks your person thinks uh, you're very intellectual, very intelligent here, um, and that you have that emotional maturity and you have that emotional intelligence here that they seek within the partner. The ten of wands here, I'm getting that there is something. Something about this connection feels a little bit weighty, a little bit burdensome. So I, I feel like when, they, when they're with their friends, they offload to their friends, their close connecting energies about the, the issues that this connection or this relationship struggles with, okay? They feel like at times, if look, if you guys have been doing this thing for a while, so if you've been in a relationship with this person for a while, like even a couple of months or, you know, onwards, they feel like it's, the connection is a little bit one-sided. They feel like they're doing, they're putting in a lot more work and doing a lot more effort than they're getting back from you. So I'm also seeing that they're offloading to their close friends. Um, you know, they're talking about some of the issues and some of the areas of the concern that this relationship, this connection struggled with. They also feel like something here feels very heavy and burdensome. I don't know why I'm getting this energy. It just feels like maybe they have some things that they haven't shared with you, okay? And they want to do that to get it off their chest, but they're coming to their friends first because they don't know how to approach the situation. I'm also seeing that your person potentially could be keeping an eye out on your social media platform, but they're doing it from a distance, okay? It's just to keep tabs on you, just to check in here and... They may not say anything to you, but I feel like they're talking to their... It's like they're telling their close connecting energy that, you know, oh, I've, you know, checked in on so-and-so's page today and this is what's going on. Or this is what he or she posted today. Or don't they just... Doesn't this photo look so cute? Okay. Um, they can't... There's something here that they're really struggling to figure out, okay? I'm also seeing that, look, your person is... There's a bit of a secretive energy to them, to this reading. So maybe your person is keeping their feelings for you under wrap. Um, maybe your person here, you know, it, there are certain things about your person that you, you don't quite know. Maybe they're having a hard time figuring you out here with the High Priestess. Your person feels a very a very strong, almost psychic-like connection to you. They feel a very strong spiritual connection to you. They feel like this is a very powerful connection. It stems beyond the physical attraction. Okay? Um, I'm seeing travel a lot. I feel like either your person here is talking about traveling... Or I don't know if you guys have spoke about doing, you know, spoke about traveling to see one another, especially for those of you that are at a distance from one another. Uh, I'm getting that, yeah, two to three. It could be two to three weeks. There could be some sort of communication or something happening here around you, around your person and this and their energy here around two to three. It could be days. It could be weeks. It could be as long as months as well. Your person is saying it's complicated. Why is it complicated right now? I'm getting the word it's complicated. They love you, you know, they love him or they love her, but it's complicated. 
or they have feelings for you, but it's not so black and white. It's complicated. It keeps the word complicated. Is, it keeps coming up. What is it that's so complicated? Is it because you know long distance? Because you guys are doing long distance. Is it because there's a misunderstanding here? Is it because it, it, there is you know it's not so simple? There's a lack of simplicity here, and there is a lot of complications that are getting in the way. They keep saying it's complicated. They keep using that word. You know, they love you, but it's complicated. They don't, you know, they want to, and they've put in a lot of effort, a lot of energy to this, um, into this connection, but it's not so, it's, it's not so simple. It's complicated. Your person feels like they've, you know, you've pushed them outside of their comfort zone in some ways. Okay, your person feels like when they were with you, they grew. Okay, they uh, grew as, you know, as a lover, as a partner here, as an individual. Some of you have done a lot of traveling together. Your person is reminiscing back on all the, like they have some very fond memories when they think back of all the fun times and the, you know, memories that the two of you have created with one another. They do a lot of reminiscing and um, a lot of reflecting here, but it, it's in a very positive light. So your person is in particular thinking about, uh, talking about how the two of you had traveled here together, or maybe you had plans to travel, and it feels like they're talking about this to their friends, about maybe the places you've been or the places that you've always wanted to see. Yes, I'm getting social media, especially if you, you know, if you follow each other's stories or if you're linked with one another on social media, I'm getting that this person is watching you closely on social media. I'm also getting that this person is missing you and they've been thinking about you a lot. They've been talking about you. They've been mentioning your name a lot, actually. It just feels like this distance this i keep getting a body of water here this distance of space here is really highlighting okay just how much they're missing you they feel like this connection is very destined they feel like you were or you are their destiny here and they feel like even if it is complicated right now they they keep saying if it's meant to be it will be or I don't know if this is a close connecting energy that keeps saying like if two people are meant to be they will end up together okay no matter the circumstances no matter the situation um, they talk about destiny a lot and how you were such an important part of their destiny and how if this is destined the two of you will come back together or you'll make it work despite the complications here if something is meant to be, it will not miss you. And this person truly believes that. Okay. And they feel like the two of you were meant to be here. Okay, guys. And these are your messages. Thank you as always for watching and listening. Please share your support by liking, sharing, and subscribing to the channel. For those of you interested in a personal reading, please feel free to connect. Otherwise, bye.